Hello, people. God dang it, Internet. <laughs>
Nah. Catherine. Yeah. I can change it later, right? Okay. <laughs> because if you think about it, Cat. Catherine. Cat. Torin. Makes sense, right? I'll teach you about a bunch of new Lumion later. Okay. For now, I need to get going. I need to go check on the Lumions. Lumions? Am I saying it right? Lumions that we've been caring for at the lab. They're all trained yet and they're starting to whatever easily. Don't forget your father wants you to go see him at the stick site. Be careful in the wood out there. Okay, um. Lumi boosts. Oh! Because you know the description, um, it just say like what the Jeff objective is. Let's see. And I could change my name, right? We just got to get stuck. Follow privacy. Okay. Um, let's go outside, I guess. Yeah, let's go. Like, oh my god, I remember Pokemon Break Prince. But you know what's different? They start with the news, not like the alarm clock. And the difference is that in the Pokemon Brick Ponce, the the mom and the dad are both famous archaeologists. And this one, my dad in this game, not my real dad, but my dad, is a has to do something with it, not the mom. That's kind of like a one change, I know. And I'm going to go around the circle, so that's my house. I guess that's my house. Um. Mm hmm. So let's see my ID. Name. Oh yeah, I could change. Warrior ID. So that's the same warrior that from the Pokemon Brick Bronze. I'm actually just really confused why they're using like the same thing, not like any other name. Do you think that's because like I don't know, nostalgic? Gastrog is loving this rain. Okay. Gastrog. Oh, they're, oh, they're all made up lure man. So they're like fan made Pokemon or Pokefix as they call it in in the Pokemon community term for people who like design Pokemon that is like non canon. The Loreman Laboratory. Uh, I'm lost. Do I go inside the laboratory or do I? Okay, let's see. So, are they using the same scripts from Pokemon Brick Bronze or? Okay, I'm checking on these young Lumians. They said they aren't threatened by this storm. Anyways, your dad was looking for you at the next side. You should go find him and see what he's wanted. Um, oh, I can't go. Oh, okay. Oh, and it's all so cute! <laughs> okay, let's go find my dad. Oh, there you are, Catherine. I see you got my message from your mother. You'll never believe what just happened. First, we are outside the st when the storm clouds appear out of nowhere. Rain came pouring down suddenly, so we ran in here to seek shelter. That's when the text on the tablet unexpectedly began to glow. The characters actually came off and completely rearranged themselves. I know it sounds crazy, but you will find that this text does not match what we previously recorded. What's happening now? An earthquake? So is that ancient... Uh... What? Just happened. I can't believe it. The tablet is actually gone. And all that research just got up and blew away. That just isn't good. You weren't able to... Finish the transcribing the new text. The pieces of the stone tablet seems to have gone off in all directions. I think someone or something did on us reading that message. We're going to have to search for all of the pieces so that we can continue to study the stone. That's odd. The race seems to have stopped. Catherine, I'm going to Lumion Laboratory to update your mother on all of this. You should meet us there when you get a chance. See you later. Um, okay. <gasps> oh my god, this music. It's so nostalgic. And the normal regular Pokemon Brick runs. 
Wait, did they get permission to do this? Hello, future to speaking out here. I am in the editing stage of my video, and I have recently learned that... Oh my god, how come I did not know this? That Lando, the creator of Pokemon Brick Bars, is the same dude who is doing the biggest project, Room and Legacy, along with some returning developers, I'm not sure. And I cannot believe I realized this. Oh my god, that was like a completely different team who is like part of like the Llama Train Studios, the ones who's developing Lumion Legacy. So no wonder why Warrior, Minus Town, all the names and the music uh sound like the set are the same, excluding the Pokemon Bows, which is different music. So um if you hear me say like the if the owners of Lumen Legacy are like gain permission from the owners of Pokemon Brick Bros and uh, that is a complete mistake and I completely apologize for that. Anyways, um just wanted to like clear that up so that um y'all don't come screaming at me. Alright, back to the video. Hey guys, Lauren. I'm glad to see that you made it back safely, sweetie. Hey champ, good to I was just catching up your mother what just happened to Dick say. So what much you were studying? That mysterious study. Um, excuse me. Honestly, I think we're around the same time that mysterious storm appeared over town. That can't be a coincidence. I believe you are right. Some after the text change on the stone was broken and the pieces were scattered in the wind. I didn't even get enough time to transcribe the new message on the tablet before the pieces disappeared. Who told me that you have disappeared the original text weeks ago? What did the original message say again? It roughly translates to the creature's secret life storming within until the day of the awakening comes again. If I could get on the pieces of the tablet back, I could set put its new message. Hopefully, whatever it says would give us some clue. Did you happen to see what they went? No, they flew in every direction. There was no telling where they could have gone. How, how do you feel about letting Catherine go on my place to search for the stones? I think that would be perfect. I've been thinking of trusting Catherine with the Lumia from, a, from the lab for quite some time now. I would love nothing more to see our child go on an adventure of Lumia's by the side, experiencing what I did when I was young. Ah yes, the life of a Lumia trainer. What do you think, Catherine? Will you help me out? Heck yeah. Your mother is offering to give you your first... Very first little man to help you along the way. Yes! That's the biggest grin I've ever seen. I say Catherine has been wanting some time like this for a while. I'm certainly not surprised one bit considering how much Catherine watches battle theater shows on TV. Um, actually I've been watching a lot of... No, I've been playing video games in my room. Uh, specifically Smash Bros. Uh, yeah. That's perfect, champ. Maybe one day you'll be on TV where you challenge a battle theater yourself. Hmm. Well then, so I need to go set up in here. Sweetheart, why don't you give Catherine a moment now, and then practice with a quick battle. That's a great idea. So she's a professor? Catherine, follow me here, and let's find you your lumen you like. Okay. This is so exciting. Picking your first lumen is so special. Lumens are lifelong companions you will never forget. Pick the one that you like the most, and whenever you decide, I'll teach you how to battle. Attention, everybody! Oh my god, they're all so cute. You all remember Catherine, don't you? Heck, no. Get around, don't be shy. Oh my god, they know me. Let's see, one of you is missing. Fafeen! Come here, Fafeen. Okay, Catherine, pick any lemon you like. Snow cub. 
Emmet, Eaglet, Triplet, Weevil. I like how they call it plant, not um grass. I think that's to avoid copyright. Uh, I don't know who to pick that. Also cute. <laughs> uh it's like a one-time choose so that you can't go back unless um I can like purchase twenty-five robux for another starter. Light. That's interesting. Okay. Uh. So, I don't know who to pick. They're all so cute. Um... As... I like the rabbits, uh... I don't know. A few moments later... That's it, I'm going with Eaglet. Yes. Great choice. What should I like name you Eaglet? Yeah. Um... Oh, you know what? He reminds me of this... Piton. I hope it doesn't get censored. Now, before we bow, I want to explain a few things. Lumens are compared to the trainer, and Bao you and Anya and Luma work together to strategize together to defeat your opponent. You'll come across many other wild Lumens and trainers, but trained Lumens who will want to battle you. The first person to burn out of Lumens that are able and willing to fight loses the match. No duh. In time, you'll learn strategies. Okay. I should be able to do this. Wait, does it wait and rest? No, I didn't know this! Okay, I'm gonna speed up everything. Got to mention that. You and your room will do fine as you go on your adventure together. I've got my gear all set up now. Come have a look. This machine will take the signals I uh, receive from the stone checks and display on screen with a general look of where they are. And once you look at that, it already detects the signal from Gal Forest. This uh, that is so far from here. It's just past Chesma Town. Well, then Shazma Town is one town over us. It's just the other side of Route 1. You should have no trouble getting there. Catherine, I need you to travel from Gale Forest so you can find the first missing tablet. Please then report back. Your mother and I will communicate you over your Lumion watch. Your Lumion watch is a powerful piece of technology that's capable of doing many things. If you find anything, give us a call and we'll decide what to do from there. So that sounds extra. Oh, take this. A closet key. Alright, um, uh, jeez, that was long. So let's see the closet key. I, I, I just kick things, okay. <gasps> oh, okay, so instead of Pokeballs, you use capture discs. That's so neat. So they're like poke so they are like pokeballs. It's just like not using the pokeball part to avoid copyright reasons. Okay. Oh he's so cute. He's just falling beside me. Um, I just named him Piton because there's a movie character, his name is Piton. And 
I was like, okay, he looks like Paton, so Paton. <laughs> okay, so let's see what kind of... Okay, yep, I get it, I get it, I get it! I have played Pokemon before! Alright! That's just falling behind me, that is so cute. Can I put him... Okay, let's see what kind of... I could look in here. Twiddle. 12 seconds later. Let's see how one Pokemon... Oh, you know what? <laughs> look at the height difference! He's so small, and I'm so... Big. So they're using all throws. Battle theaters. Is that like gym battle? <laughs>
I think this could be a more options added for saving so that you know it doesn't get bugged. I hope my data doesn't get reset. <laughs> um, so I guess I'll stop here. I this leads up to the first battle theater. I'm trying to say not to say gym battle because it's not called gym battle. It's called battle theater. I guess they're like changing everything to avoid copyright from Pokemon. That's why a lot of there's like a lot of different. I almost said Pokemon, dang it. Lumion and uh, different items and different moves. They're like some that are like from Pokemon, but like Pounce is I'm kind of like inspired by like Pound or Tackle or Scratch and still like a. I don't know what they're called, like the. I guess inspiration. So, uh. I guess, uh. Thank y'all so much for watching. And. Hey, some Pokemon girl. Ah! I'm failing at taking a video now. Apparently, I know it's been a while since I've done a video. Don't blame me. I have a part-time job, but I've been working ever since, and I've been doing some other art-related things. I know what y'all are thinking. Anyways, uh, I hope y'all enjoy this video. Um. And I will link this game down below in the description box if you want to go check it out yourself. And uh, Patron woke up as soon as I saw them leaving. Alright. See you guys in the next video. I guess in the next video, yep. I'm going to be continuing this series. And uh, bye.